In this video we're going to walk through the steps to configure a USB gamepad for use with Mach 3 as a jog and incremental move pendant. In terms of which gamepads work best, we don't endorse a particular gamepad but there are a number of good options. The important thing is that it should be compatible with your version of Windows and show up as a game controller. Here we can see the Xbox 360 wireless controller for Windows includes a USB transceiver. Another popular controller is the GamePad F310 from Logitech. This is a wired controller. And the wireless version of that controller is also available called the F710. Whichever controller you choose, the important thing is that it shows up under Game Controllers in Windows. The first step is to download the plugin. We'll go to the Mach Support website, Mach 3 Plugins, and scroll down to the Joypad Game Device plugin. It's worth noting that we're not affiliated with the author of this Mach 3 plugin, but we've heard good things and some of us have used it with good results. Navigating to the Joypad author's website, we'll find a download page. And as of time of making this video, there are two downloads available. Normally I wouldn't recommend the beta, but in this case it does work better with motion control plugins such as the Ethernet Smooth Stepper, which comes with most of our machines. So I would start with that. With the plugin downloaded, we can extract the plugin files. Our next step is to copy or move the extracted joypad.dll file to the Mach 3 plugins directory. We'll start Mach 3 as normal. And we'll navigate to Config and Config Plugins and enable the Joypad plugin. When we press Config, we'll see the following message if we did not install the gamepad or if the gamepad is not registered properly with Windows. After connecting the gamepad, we see it show up in Game Controllers under the Windows Control Panel. With the gamepad installed, we can go to Config and enable the joypad. With the default key mappings, jogging is accomplished using the left B button, which is my left index finger in this video, and using my thumb to control the left joystick. 